Hi guys, okay, this is the Daily Food Diary. Um, I've included it as one of the files. So it's titled Daily Food Diary, believe it or not. Isn't that a bit of a strange one? But there you go. Um, so, Daily Food Diary. Name, pop your little name in here. Date, the date that you're going to start, which is obviously going to be Monday. Let's have a look at the date there, 28 today. It'll be the 29th. And what I want you to do is I want you to put a little circle around Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, Friday, Saturday, and Sunday. Now, this is the important bit. Because what you need to do is you need to be writing down exactly what it is that you're having, what time it is that you're having it, and any notes on how you felt afterwards. Some people don't really feel hungry afterwards. Uh, some people feel like they still need to snack. Some people feel bloated. So really just try and put as much information down as you can. I'll explain the reasons why with regards to um, putting stuff down in the notes a little bit later on. So quantity so let's give you an example let's say that you are having two eggs so you'll write down two whoops a daisy look at that wrong one you'll write down uh, two no three even flipping neck you're hungry okay so two eggs uh ugh, i'm trying to hold the mic at the same time you see i'm not doing very good two eggs and they can be scrambled poached whatever it is that you want whatever time that you add it and notes now you might have a really big breakfast so you might have like a portion of spinach you might have a little bit of a broccoli whatever that it is but whatever that you have please put it down here okay same goes for lunch same goes for dinner same goes for any snacks that you may have again time and notes um this is made for, to be honest with you, this is made for the guys that are on either my physical program or are on any of my online programs or the 30-day program. It all depends. It's the same bog-standard form that we use. Um, so if you guys are taking any supplements, it's always good to pop it in there. You may want to have a consultation at some point, and it'd be just really dead handy. The first thing that I'd say to you is do us a favor, do the daily food diary, whiz it over to me, and I can have a little look at exactly where it is that you're either going right or you're going wrong. Okay, so cross out how many litres of water. You start your day with this, the lemon water, which we've already discussed. Hopefully that you guys have got the email and you're all set up for that. If you're not, get it sorted because you're going to need to get it because that's where all the information is. Um, three litres of water. I really want you to try your best to get as much down as you possibly can. I will explain exactly the reasons why we're going to need water in there, but you need to flush shite out of your system not literally shite but uh, toxic stuff that's going to go back into your blood system that needs to go out we're also going to be drinking the green and white teas and any other herbal teas just put a little x okay how was your day self-evaluation this is really really important because if you've had a great day then chances are you'll have stuck to all the suggestions that I've given you. If you've had a crap day, chances are you haven't. You've been a little bit stressed, you've had an argument, whatever. But the fact is, is that self-evaluation is really important. It makes you sit back and look at what it is that you've done. And if you craved something, let's say, for example, if you had an argument with someone or you did feel stressed, did you reach for the Mars bars or Twixes or whatever it is that you really enjoy having? So, guys, self-evaluation. And how did I do today? Did I do excellent? Great. Okay. Not good. Very bad. Oof. Let's try and keep away from them. And let's try and keep to these excellent and great. We like a little bit of positivity. We know that the world, unfortunately, is a little bit negative every now and again. However... Let's try and keep as positive as we possibly can. So, guys, daily food diary. Get it printed. Get seven of them off in front of you and start writing them down. Have an absolutely incredible day, and I look forward to speaking to you really soon. Take care. Bye-bye.